Hello guys, welcome back from the video. So in this video, we will be doing a side by side comparison of Lichi application and Rainbow application on DJI Mini 2. So after watching this video completely, you guys will get to know which one is better in terms of price and the uh, features. So don't miss this video and don't uh, skip this video. Watch this video completely till the end. So without wasting much time, let's quickly get into the video guys. So guys, firstly, let's begin with the Lichi application. So this is the interface that we get on the Lichi application once it's connected with your drone. So guys, as we all know, Lichi and the Rainbow application are both provide the same services. So almost both the applications are same in the features and uh, the functionality. So in this video, we will be doing the main comparison that is the tracking. With this, we will get to know which one is more stable in terms of tracking and following. So guys, to do the hand on hand comparison, I have raised the drone altitude to 2.5 meters and distance I'm keeping here is around 5 meters. So as you can see guys, I have started the tracking and let's walk and test it whether the lychee will be able to track us in the correct format. So guys, as you can see on the screen, when the object is moving away from the drone, drone is unable to track that object and follow that object. So the tracking area that is getting larger uh, when the object is moving away and at some point it is saying that follow is ended due to the low confidence and it starts hunting for the object. So here guys, uh, Lichi fails to track the object perfectly and uh, even it won't follow the object perfectly. So guys, now let's do the same test on the Rainbow application. So here guys, I am using Rainbow Pro app and in the Lichi also, I was using the paid version of the Lichi. So both are the paid versions. Lychee as well as the rainbow application here guys we are into the rainbow application you can see this is the interface that we get on the rainbow application so guys let's quickly move to the tracking and start with the follow mode so here also we will be keeping the same parameters as of the Lychee application here our altitude is uh, around 2.2 uh, meters and our distance is same as 5 meters as in the Lychee so here guys I have started the tracking as well as the follow mode combined so guys, as you can see on the screen, the tracking on this rainbow application works perfectly than compared to the Lychee application. So guys, whenever the object is moving away, the tracking uh, box that stays at the same position and whenever the object is moving in different direction also, drone keeps on tracking the object perfectly. With this guys, somewhere I feel that rainbow application is doing better in the tracking when compared to the Lychee application. So guys, you got the results of the tracking that is both on uh, Lychee and the Rainbow application. Apart from this guys, the interface, when it comes to the interface, they provide the same kind of interface. Uh, they provide us the GPS points that are available on the drone, the RC remote uh, battery status, as well as the drone uh, battery status. So guys, both the application provide us the same kind of interface and same kind of features. Both have the uh, waypoint, orbit, hyperlapse and tracking feature, follow me mode and FPV. So guys, if you people ask me why you did not compare other features that are available on Lychee and Rainbow application. So guys, as mentioned previously, interface is completely same. And when it comes to the waypoint, orbit, uh, hyperlapse and other features like FPV and uh, hyperlapse and everything, both the apps do their job perfectly. And there is no point of doing the comparison when they are working completely fine. And there is no difference that we can find in Rainbow application and the Lychee application for these features. So here we are primarily focusing on tracking and follow me because these two have the main uh, difference between this Lychee and the Rainbow application. Now guys, let's do the tracking. Uh, we will not use the follow me and we'll be just using the tracking feature that is available on the Lychee application. Now we are into Lychee application as you can see on the screen. So I have selected the object. So you can see guys, when the object is moving, the tracking box is getting larger and it is not tracking the object. So guys, tracking works like a tripod mode. Here our drone does not move according to the object. If the object moves away or towards the drone, the drone will not change its uh, position. It will stay in one position and it will track the object changing its direction. So guys, as you saw on the screen, drone was not able to track me perfectly with the help of Lychee application. So let's do the same test on the Rainbow application now. So guys, I am at the same position where I ended up with the Lychee application. Now I am into the Rainbow application and I am starting 
uh, the tracking at the same position where I had stopped from the Lychee application. So guys, as you can see on the screen, I'm not using the follow mode. I'm just using the tracking here also. So our drone is tracking the object perfectly. So guys, even when the object is moving far or towards the drone, drone is perfectly tracking the object. Even you can see on the screen that I'm running still our drone is uh, changing its direction and tracking the object perfectly. So guys, with this uh, comparison, I hope you guys have got to know that how the tracking feature is working with the Lychee application and with the Rainbow application. So here talking about the price, Lychee offers the paid version of the Lychee application at 2200 rupees and the Rainbow app offers the paid version of Rainbow Pro app at 1100 rupees on the Play Store. I will be adding the link to uh, purchase the both uh, Rainbow application as well as Lychee application in the description. You guys can check out and uh, whichever you are interested in, you can go with those app guys. I have made it clear that which is working totally fine. But guys, we should make a note that Lychee is still working on the beta version. So I think when it comes to the uh, updated version of the Lychee application, this error will be fixed. So that's it for this video guys, I hope you have liked this video and found this video informative. After watching this video completely, you might have got a clear knowledge which one is better in terms of price and in terms of features. So that's it for this video guys, uh, if you guys have liked this video, please do hit a like button and subscribe to the channel. This motivates me to create some more content like this. So we'll meet in the next video, till then take care, bye bye.